There seems to be something that's gone wrong with the uh, Vikram, uh, with the uh, Chandrayaan mission, the Vikram lander, moments before it was supposed to make a soft landing on the surface of the moon. Something appears to have gone wrong. It's now been several minutes since the scheduled touchdown time. Uh, the expressions at Mission Control Center in, uh, in Bengaluru appear to have changed completely. The chairman of ISRO has, been, uh, has briefed the Prime Minister uh, and um, there was a particular curve, uh, a particular path, a simulated path which the Vikram lander was following. Uh, the initial set of engines which had to fire to slow down its rate of descent from 1.8 kilometers per second uh, to almost zero kilometers per second ultimately did fire. It was uh, working meticulously, flawlessly, absolutely. Uh, the, rough, uh, the, uh, the rough breaking phase appeared to have ended and uh, which was supposed to be followed by what's called the fine braking phase when another set of engines uh, was supposed to have fired but it was at that stage literally seconds before touchdown that all communication appears to have been lost and since then we are waiting for some sort of announcement uh, from ISRO uh, the Prime Minister has been briefed he's moved down now uh, as these scientists uh, in uh, in ISRO there were cheers there were claps uh, moments back uh, when Things appeared to be going okay. There, were act, there was active commentary as well uh, as, as India cheered on each and every moment. At this stage, these scientists are trying to find out just what went wrong. Has the Vikram lander uh, touched down? And is there a problem of telemetry, of communication? Uh, has there been a failure of the final uh, engine, which was supposed to uh, reduce its rate of descent to absolutely zero kilometers? Uh, vertically and, and horizontally for it to make uh, a proper touchdown. What exactly has happened? What went wrong? There's still no word from ISRO. Uh, the commentary which was being provided by the scientists uh, has been turned off. At this stage, we are hoping uh, for some good news, but I'm afraid at this stage, it doesn't appear to be good news uh, as, uh, as well. Uh, Mr. Raghunandan, this is... Uh, it's probably too early for us to reach anything definitive at this stage. We can still hope against hope. But I think it, it's fair to say that something has gone wrong. It's not yeah. gone according to plan. Uh, the extent to which uh, there's been a problem, we don't know the extent of that. Yet. See, the fine landing phase had started, which means all the four throttleable uh, engines yeah. were still yeah. going. Now that should have... Can I just interrupt you for a moment? Let's go across to NDTV Science Editor Pallav Bagla. Pallav, uh, what are you hearing? Well, we aren't hearing anything from inside the Mission Control Center. What we can say for sure, that the faces of the scientists, which we can see from inside the Mission Control Center, are very grim. They are not showing the same signs. There are no claps which happened when 1.55 a.m. came and passed. Uh, there was a lot of confabulation and talking which happened between the scientists. The, all the chairmen of ISRO got together. They came to the Prime Minister. The Prime Minister spoke, spoke to them. Then the Prime Minister himself came down the stairs. And he, 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 when he came down from Mangalyan, he came down clapping. This time he was not clapping. He came down in a very grim, the grim face. But I think we need to wait and watch.